Will Smith walking up on stage and cracking Chris Rock with an open hand slap. I want to get a full breakdown on that shot, the lack of reaction from Chris Rock, and uh, what you thought of uh, the, 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 the shot and the reaction. Well, I want to make it very clear. I wasn't watching. I had to watch the replay. I, I, wasn't, I wasn't spending my Sunday night watching the Academy Awards and all these elitists and all these people that live in a bubble and live in a make-believe world or a different world than most of us uh, earthlings have to live in. Uh, I, I, so that's, that's, that has to be full transparency, always on this show. Uh, that has to be brought out first. As far as the punch, it was fat. It was wide. You know, it was wide. You could, uh, he's lucky he didn't have a good counter punch in front of him. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's lucky that Mayweather wasn't up for uh, an academy, you know, uh, because Mayweather would have counted the crap out. And so that, that's number one. And I understand. It was open hand and all that stuff. Uh, either Chris Rock has the greatest chin uh, since uh, Ali, uh, and Kid Gavilan, Kid Gavilan, by the way, uh, Google, uh, 155, whatever. I, I don't know if he was ever dropped. I don't think he was even dropped. I mean, what a chin. Uh, he's got the, either Chris Rock is known, and we didn't know this going into this, that the name Rock came because of his chin. You know, he's got a granite chin. <laughs> either that or Mr. Smith, he needs to go back to the training he was doing for the Ali film, and he's got to work on the power a little more. He's got to work on the power a little bit more. Uh, maybe a lot more. Maybe a lot. That shows you really the magic of Hollywood, that you could take a guy that, you know, hits like a feather duster and make him into Muhammad <laughs> Ali and, and knock out George Foreman. I mean, that's amazing. That credit to those directors, credit to those cinematographers, all of them, uh, really. Uh, I got more respect for them and understanding for what they do now than I did before. So if that's worth anything, I gained something. <laughs> <laughs> I gained a little something. And um, I think that, I think that Chris did roll with it a little bit, you know, Ken? I think he rolled with it, yeah. uh, you know, yep. a little bit. Uh, so maybe that took a little off of it, maybe. But Would you like to have seen Chris Rock come right back over the top with the right hand, straight right down I would have, if not over the top with the right hand, it was coming round. So it might have been hard to estimate the distance of it because when it's round it could be longer and if you try to come over the top and you pull him back to do that you still could get caught so i would have liked to see him weave it <laughs> I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm geez i'm i'm asking for a lot here i would have liked to see him weave it to his left and come up with a nice left hook a nice left hook and and just you know and then i may have stayed with the i i may have been i might have said you know what I watched this one on video. Next year, I'm going to watch the Academy Awards because you never know, baby. Yeah, you just, it was the best thing just, that's ever happened to the I, Academy Awards. I might watch Awards. it next year. They might have gotten somebody. I'll be honest. I, they might have. I had your I had your voice in my head when you did it. I was like, oh, dude, why throw one slap when you can throw two or three? Because you just never know when you might find a prospect uh, at the Academy Awards. <laughs> yeah, you know, who who knew? Who knew? But uh, <laughs> I, I tell you, uh, we joke and everything, but like I said earlier, uh, well, what's going on in this country and in this world right now, uh, what I think we got more serious. I, it's good to, look, it's good to get an escape and to laugh. I get it. And um, sports is an escape. And I guess now the Academy Awards might be an escape. I don't know. Uh, because... <laughs> I, we do have stuff that's going on right now. Uh, I don't know that these people uh, understand it or see it or get touched by it or feel it uh, the way the ordinary human beings uh, do on this planet. But there are some serious things going on in this country and in this world that need to be paid attention to. <laughs> <laughs> 